All right, folks, gather round. We've got a doozy today, an apple coil that supposedly reverses gravity. I mean, who wouldn't want to save Newton from his own apple mishap, right? <laughs> Let's just hope we don't end up floating around this cargo bay like a bunch of confused schmucks. If we do end up floating, at least we'll have a new perspective on Newton's theories. Just imagine, an apple a day keeps gravity at bay. Now let's see if this coil can really make Newton's apple fly back up to the tree. If this coil works, we might just rewrite physics and make Newton roll in his grave, upwards. But let's not get ahead of ourselves. Last time, Benefactor nearly turned us into human pinballs. Keep your helmets on, folks, just in case we defy gravity a little too well. Helmets on, check. If we start bouncing around, I'll just pretend it's an avant-garde dance routine. Let's hope this time we stick the landing and not the ceiling. If we end up on the ceiling, at least we'll have a new angle for our next episode. Gravity-defying dance moves. Just remember, avant-garde or not, the goal is to save Newton, not become the next Cirque du Soleil act. Benefactor, please keep the chaos to a minimum this time. I'll do my best, but you know me. Chaos is my middle name. If we do end up in a circus act, at least we'll have a captive audience in orbit. Let's just hope Newton's apple doesn't turn into a cosmic boomerang. If it does, we'll have to dodge it like we're in an interstellar dodgeball match. Just remember, the goal is to save Newton, not to become the apple's next target. Benefactor, let's aim for a scientific breakthrough, not a cosmic comedy show. Well... If we do end up in a cosmic comedy, at least we'll have a stellar punchline. But seriously, let's keep our eyes on the prize. Newton's legacy deserves more than just a fruit salad in space. And remember, folks, gravity's not just a good idea, it's the law. And breaking that law could land us in a gravitational courtroom with Newton as the judge. Let's make sure our apple coil doesn't turn into a fruit-flinging fiasco. After all, we're here to honor Newton, not turn his theories into a cosmic joke. All right, folks, with our apple coil ready, let's challenge gravity and maybe give Newton some competition. Helmets on, fingers crossed. Whether it's success or cosmic comedy, it's all for science and a bit of fun. Join us next time as we attempt to prove that when gravity gets cheeky, even Newton might just let his wig float.